Endometriosis is a condition characterized by the growth of the inner lining of the womb outside of it. Symptoms and severity can vary among individuals, but common symptoms include dysmenorrhea, which is painful period, dyskesia, which is pain during bowel opening, dysuria, painful passing urine, and dysperonia, pain during section to cause chronic pelvic pain, cyclical bowel or urinary symptoms, chronic fatigue, and abnormal menstrual bleeding. So diagnosis involves a thorough evaluation of a patient's medical history, a pelvic examination, and an ultrasound is very important to evaluate a patient. A definitive diagnosis typically requires a laparoscopy surgery, which allows for the identification and removal of endometriotic tissue. Endometriosis can cause female infertility, particularly when accompanied by pain-related symptoms. So fertility preservation options for individuals with endometriosis who wish to conceive in the future vary depending on the severity of the condition. There is no universal approach to manage endometriosis and the most suitable strategy for fertility preservation depends on the factors such as the severity of the condition, the patient's age, the size of their ovarian cysts, any previous ovarian surgery, and the patient's ovarian reserve. In some circ circumstances, IVF may be the first line treatment option depending on the specific circumstances. Severe endometriosis can be challenging to manage and treatment approaches vary based on the factors like the extent of the disease, symptom severity, and individual goals. Excision surgery has shown effectiveness in elevating pain-related symptoms and is often the preferred treatment choice. Laparoscopy or robotic-assisted laparoscopy is commonly used due to its ability to provide clear visualization of the pelvic area, enabling surgeons to remove endometriotic tissue and scarring. This can lead to pain relief and improved fertility in some cases. Additionally, hormonal therapy may be employed to regulate estrogen levels and suppress endometriosis growth, inflammation and scarring. Energetics such as NSAIDs may also be necessary to manage breakthrough pain. Diagnosing severe endometriosis typically involves a combination of detailed medical history taking, clinical evaluation and imaging studies. However, some patients with severe endometriosis may not show any symptoms. Hence, treatment options for severe endometriosis depends on the severity of the symptoms and fertility desire. It is important for patients to engage in discussion with their gynecologist, undergo a comprehensive evaluation and tailored treatment plan to address their specific symptoms and needs. One common misconception about endometriosis is that pelvic pain during menstruation is normal, which can lead to delayed in the diagnosis and unnecessary suffering. Hence, it is important to raise public awareness that such pain should be considered abnormal until proven otherwise. Another myth is that endometriosis always causes infertility, but while it does increase the risk, not all individuals with endometriosis are infertile many can still conceive with or without fertility treatment.